Hi everybody, welcome back. Glad you guys are here on my secondary channel. Last time you guys saw this thing, I towed that giant Suburban to the shop with it, which was very risky business because the floor, yeah, the floor is rotting out of this trailer. I bought this new in 2017 or 2018, I think. And uh, it's it's about done for. So I, uh, I need to use this trailer to move some more vehicles but uh, I need to put a floor in it first. So that is what we're going to do today. We're gonna hook up to this thing, tow it to the big box orange store that sells lumber, and we're going to get a series of 16 foot two by sixes. I think it takes 11 of them and some Thompson's water seal, and we're gonna redo this floor. Then after I'm done fixing the trailer, I can tow it back to the shop and pick up that car. The flatbed trailer is a two inch ball and all my other trailers are a two and five sixteenths ball. So I need to change this receiver real quick like, and then we can hook up and get out of here. Starting the engine. All right, let's go ahead and get these hooked up. Okay, let's get it chained and we'll hook up the brakes and uh, lights, check those, we're ready to ride. I always take trailer blocks with me, just in case the trailer loses a tire or something and I can't tow on. You may need that block to get the trailer off of your truck. So I always bring those just in case, because you never know. Power. Okay, we have running lights, brake lights, running lights, brake lights, we're good. Got what I need. Two by six by sixteen. I need eleven of them, so I think I'm gonna get twelve. There we go. All right, our dudes at Home Depot helped me load this thing up. Props to him. Let's get it strapped in. And we're off to go find a gate. I realized this would probably be just fine without a strap to secure it down, but in that event I encounter a uh, BMW person, I would like to have some extra security on the load. A lot of BMW drivers get in a real big hurry. They'll cut you off, make you blow your load. Yeah. Okay, we fast forwarded again. We're out back of a tractor supply. And I just picked up a pair of new gates. One will go in in front of the garage, and then one is gonna be an entry gate uh, to the property. This one, or the old one, is starting to rust out, and uh, I wanna stay ahead of the destruction, so I ended up picking up a, another one. So I've got the stuff to do the trailer, got some spray paint, got two gates for the shop, and we are out of here. Time to go get some work done. All right, everybody, we're wrapping it up. I've got this, uh, trailer backed into the shop. I guess uh, first things first is I need to get all this stuff unloaded and uh, start pulling these old boards up. Um, I made a gross error in judgment. 
See, I, I purchased 16 foot lengths of uh, two by sixes. Problem is, is these are two by eights and I, I just didn't notice. So I think I actually ended up three boards or four boards short. So that being said, I may just have to make another trip uh, to the store to pick up those remaining, uh, remaining planks. However, I can get most of this done. So coming up next and probably in another video, I'm gonna go ahead and pull up all these boards get all this uh, demoed and broken down, and uh, then I can start laying these new ones and we'll get those bolted in. Then the trailer will be back in operating condition. Then I can go fetch that, uh, that piece of crap Toyota that's still sitting in the parking lot like two months later. Because we have things to do and I need this trailer to do them. And I think while I'm at it, I can uh, touch up some of this rust. This, uh, this hurts my heart. I bought this trailer new in 2018, I think, and now it's it's, uh, it's shown some age. It's unfortunate, but a little bit of a restore. We'll sort that out, no problem. Should be good as new. Couple cans of spray paint. Need to fix up some wires. Clean that off. Redo the deck, and I'm gonna, going to water seal these planks. Oh, you know what? While we're here, I forgot. I managed to get a new cover for this uh, breaker panel. I remember when uh, when I first came in, this um, this whole panel cover was gone and it was missing. And uh, I could not replace just the cover. I could not find one. So I ended up having to buy an entire breaker panel just to just to get the cover. Now, I'm sure somebody out there is going to be able to find one and I'm going to get a link for it. And, and that's okay, because if you have one, I will take it because I need it to complete this panel right here. I don't know what I'll do with a completed panel, but I'll do something with it. So yeah, progress has been slow, um, but it's moving along slowly but surely. All right, everybody, I'm going to wrap it up. Before I go, I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video. I certainly do appreciate it. Let me know what you think about this video in the comment section down below. And I will catch you guys for part two of the trailer rebuild. So again, thank you guys for watching. And most importantly, don't forget, have a great night. See you guys later.